What is up everybody and welcome back to more Let's Play Pixelmon. So today what we're going to do is travel over to this town right here and this is, I don't know what the name of the town is actually to be honest, but I figured hey we could go over there, travel and um, hopefully find some cool new fun things to do there. I don't know about anything fun, but maybe even try and capture, what someone gave me a suggestion to do was uh, try and capture every single Pokemon in the mod. And I thought that was actually not that bad of an idea since I do have a pretty high number of Pokeball discs or ultra balls so i figured hey why not we could go for that i don't know how successful we'll be in that endeavor but can't really hurt to attempt to do that at least right so what i'm gonna do now is uh, i guess we'll just battle this guy and uh, wow that's probably one of the worst pokemon i could have led with right there but electabuzz should be able to just tear through this team and unless he dies and he gets poisoned wow that just kind of screwed me over a little bit but thunder punch we do have and that is quite the solid move and oh we got a crit there you go lapras uh oh lapras does a lot of damage, or it's pretty tanky, but at the same time, we get lots of experience. So, confused, right? So, now I'm confused and poisoned as I take a drink of water. That was fun. And now we are waiting. That's always fun, you know, just chilling like a villain over there with the Snorlax over here. And, uh, yeah, so I figured, hey, we should try and do that and get all of the Pokemon in the mod. Um, we obviously do have a Snorlax already. I am hurt by confusion. Um, I snapped out. Luckily, yeah, well, we snapped out pretty early there, but we only have four health, so we will die this turn. And, um, yeah. So, oh, wow, everyone's almost dead already on my team, so this isn't good. Um, what do I use? Um, I guess Horn Attack is the best bet here, but I get the feeling that, yeah, he's going to do lots of damage to me. So, unless I get a crit or something, I mean, I think I could survive two more of those. Unless he uses Growl, that works too. So, I th and I think it'll take two more to actually kill him. So, let's continue to do that Horn Attack one more time. This should be it, and we should be able to pull through after this one. Oh, unless we... Oh my god, if he kills me because he got that confused right off, I will be very, very angry. Ice Shard, super effective, and oh, he totally is, isn't he? Don't do it. Don't do it. Pull through, Rhyhorn. And there you go. He didn't kill it. Are you kidding me? How did it not kill it? And is, oh my god, alright, so who do we, if Swinup can actually pull through for this, he will probably get a quite, or a lot of experience, and um, that would definitely be good. So let's try a Powder Snow, as I almost yawn, and he puts me to sleep, oh joy, joy, so I get the feeling Swinup is just not going to power through on this one now. So let's go Jinx, and come on, he's so low, you could totally pull through for me Jinx. And here, just do an ice punch that should finish him off. Come on, Jinx. You're kidding. How did it not kill it? I mean, it has, we've already done like two attacks when it has no thing. No health. Really? That's BS. Jinx is sleeping. Growl. Jinx wakes up. Alright, Jinx, you have to kill it with this ice punch. Come on, pull through, buddy. How? Why'd it go first? What? Ah, what? That is ridiculous. This is starting to get frustrating. And all right, but we could still pull through on this one. And uh, all right, use growl. Jinx, Jinx wakes up. All right, if it uses sing again, I rage. All right, we used ice punch, and there's still another Pokemon, but that's okay. Oh, it's another Lapras, so we should probably die in a turn or two because we do no damage. And yep, we're gonna get confused anyway. <sighs> so we can try like a powder snow or something silly. Why am I keep yawning? It's weird. I don't like it. Don't like it one bit. And all right, so that is that. We are now all killed off, and uh, we can continue traveling to this town though. And um, obviously, so they did make a little almost monorail s thing, but I did not use that. I chose to not use it. And yeah, so we can continue traveling this way, and hopefully, we can find something fun to do over here. And let's see, is anyone? Or is anything fun happening? I don't even see anybody over here. And there's just this general stuff. So what, we have Carry Bear, Tyranno, General... Oh, these are the residents. I see. I see, I see, I see. So what we can do, though... Oh, God, what happens to this guy's house? Or is this just in construction? I don't know. Um, all right, so where is the healer and those things? I have to find that, and then that'll make my life so much more... Uh, so much simpler once we could heal our Pokemon up. And I think it is this way. I've never really walked to this town, only teleported here, so it is kind of confuzzling. And, oh no, it's gone. Hmm. Well, that's a problem. Everything's gone from this town. It looks like it was looted. Well, that's not good. Um, yeah, I don't know. Uh, this is weird. Free enchanting station. There's that. 
and but no healer unfortunately it looks like so what we're gonna have to do is whoa look at that look at the ultra ball or oh, the great ball on top that actually looks pretty cool so let's go run this way and you can tr see what that is i mean that actually does look really really cool i think i saw someone building this before but i don't know if it was this far in construction so this guy's bound to have a um a healer or something like that i really just need a healer not so much a pc but I mean, either or will really help me here. Should have put an ultra ball somewhere too. Maybe on the other side. Stop yawning. It's annoying me. So, uh, the water elevators. Not my favorite thing in the world. Not gonna lie. So, there's a PC. Come on, there's gotta be a healer in this place. So, we got a PC. Worst case scenario, I, I guess we could switch out all of my Pokemon. And healer? Healer? No healer. So, um, but this is actually pretty cool, and it has a nice landing bay. I don't know who built this, but this is very pretty. I like this quite a bit, and it has a pretty awesome view as well. So, I don't see anything, just a little farm going on right there, and no healer, right? It's not like I'm missing it, and it's going to be all awkward. No, oh, and he has um, the hopper system set up, or is that what they're called? Was that a diamond? Oh, no, I thought I saw a diamond. I was like, whoa, diamonds. So, we can eat some food because I do not want to starve to death. I actually have to get out of this water, though. <laughs> Struggling with that. And, alright, so now he obviously has some apricorns there. Just an ultra ball farm, though. So, I don't really see any healers. This is kind of problematic. I mean, there's got to be one at spawn. Oh, I can't use slash spawn because chat's off. So, let's go chat, shown, slash spawn. Nope, that's not how you spell spawn. Slash spawn. And we can go back. Oh. Oops. So we can go back, multiplayer settings, hidden, and there's not a healer here either. Alright, the quest for a healer continues. So I don't, I still don't see any of these. Um, here, I'll just find a healer and I'll come back once I get it. BRB. So I am back now after finding my healer and there's some blocks on the floor there. Okay, so, and here, so we can act... What? Oh, 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 those are all the things I took out. So, yeah, I will access my PC, and we could find some, just get a general idea of what Pokemon we don't have. So, obviously, the Sand Slash, I'm only, I'm not going to do the evolutions. Like, I don't want to do, I'll just get the one Pokemon in the evolution line, and that'll be good enough. As, um, I don't think we really need all of them. Um, as I hit my headphones and they get all screwed up and now i can't hear myself and now it's glitching out oh god hold on wait it's kind of working hold on let me fix this so now battery switched we are back and good to go so there is a sand shrew over here and i may want to capture you sand shrew and sand dial i think i will want to catch today oh even them and we could shoot for a golem in the next few episodes because that's a pretty awesome pokemon to get so should i just try and get uh no see what we could do we could go for you and try and put it to sleep so let's go with jinx and here we can do a lovely kiss is that what he puts it to sleep wait what does lovely kiss do again it missed anyway so i guess it doesn't really matter but um yeah so i think that'll be kind of fun to do that over the next couple episodes is just try and capture all of the pokemon and hopefully an ice punch does not kill it i don't think it will it did okay <laughs> um all right so let's go try and find maybe a sand slash would be a better idea then so um yeah we can shoot to try and capture the sand slash and there's a sand dial here as well the sand dial i bet i could just almost capture just with one pokeball and that is a big sand true i want to capture you so let's just try and put this to sleep and then try the Pokeball. And let's see. Waiting. Waiting. <laughs> Waiting to initiate the battle. Um, yeah, I don't know. Just taking its sweet time and no big deal. It's the sh it's bad news bears right there. So Sandshrew is still sleeping. So let's go bag. We can do Pokeballs. And we do have 11 Ultra Balls. So I still have tons of Ultra Ball lids. So there is no problem with that. And actually, did we catch that Sand Dial? I think we did. Because over the... Oh, nope, we didn't clearly because it's roaming around two feet away from me. So uh, yeah, definitely going to have to do that. And let's see. Did it capture? It's just still waiting. And there you go. So we did capture that. And that's actually a little tiny Sand Dial, which is kind of cool. So maybe we should try and do that. Let's find a tiny Sand Dial. They all look the same size though um i don't even know <gasps> look at the tiny trap inch but that is in the evolution line of flygon so we don't need to capture one of them and let's see oh look at the little tiny um whatever you're called there's two of them uh graveler so let's go graveler we can put you to sleep then do a couple ice punches and hopefully we can uh actually uh kill you uh well no 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 Wait, no, I don't want to kill you. So, oh yeah, this is perfect. So, if we do another ice punch, and hopefully he doesn't wake up after this. Don't tell me. Alright. 
And we can go bag, Pokeballs, Ultra Ball, don't wake up, damn it. I'll hurt you, Gravel. All right, good. It's before he can wake up. So this should definitely be an easy capture as um, just he's such low health asleep and uh, yeah, just perfect situation to capture him right here. So let's see, waiting. Do, 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 do. Do I have a Graveler? No, but we can get a Golem right now if you really wanted to, but I think I will hold up. Whoa, Jesus, don't do that. Um, uh, so here, let's see. We could probably just put Sandile to sleep and capture him. So let's try that. So just using Lovely Kiss on everyone and, oh, it missed. Damn it. All right, we got this though. Lovely Kiss for the win. Come on, lovely. There you go. So, falling asleep, and he is still sleeping, so we can go for Pokeballs, and we're definitely going to need to get some more Pokeballs over the next few episodes, but I don't think that'll be too difficult. I think we should be fine in that sense. It was kind of refreshing to capture new Pokemon, so I'm going to try and figure out what Pokemon, between this episode and next episode, figure out what Pokemon I do need, and oh, there you go, so we did capture him again, and seriously, lovely kissing everything is just really becoming quite beneficial, and oh, we're gonna need one of you too, because I didn't get you in this Let's Play, oh wait, oh, oh god, he's taking the initiative, isn't he? So we can do a rock blood, that's gonna do no damage whatsoever. Or he could just use Dig, which is going to do ridiculous amounts of damage. So we can go to Jinx, who should be able to take out Sand Slash. Okay, or maybe not. So let's do an Ice Punch, which should do nice amounts of damage and decent damage. Oh, we got the Freeze. All right, that saved me because I was actually a little worried we were going to die there. But uh, that should save me unless it breaks out in like one turn. And it doesn't. So we should be able to finish this guy off now. Ice Punch, super effective. And he's still frozen, so yeah. We should beat him right here, because I don't think, I think Ice Punch is a 100% hit ratio, and look, they both level up, so that is good. So, oh, a Magnemite, actually, I don't have any of you, so what we can do is just go like that. So, let's do, yeah, we're going to open up a Lovely Kiss, I think, on just most, almost all of these Pokemon. So, he is asleep now, and are you thinking Ice Punch? No, let's try and Powder Snow instead, because that definitely should not kill it. It wasn't, oh wow, that's actually really lucky. That did, uh, like, the perfect amount of damage. Yeah, Ice Punch definitely would have killed him. But the Powder Snow, getting really close, and it wasn't very effective. That's kind of weird. I don't know why it did so much damage. As I take a drink of water. Sorry, I just seem to be very parched today. So, we can wait here, waiting, do 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 and yes, yeah, so that was another successful capture, so already three Pokemon down, and I don't know how many to go. We have a pretty wide variety of Pokemon, I think. Considering we don't need the evolutions, I think we'll, we'll be fine. The hardest one's going to be Mew. One we, and actually, someone has a Mew, so maybe I could even trade for it. Hey, who knows? But, uh, yeah, so that would be fun. And maybe even some later on, we could try and shoot for every sh Pokemon shiny, but I think that's just damn near impossible. I don't think we would be able... I don't have enough time in my hands to sit here and try and do that. But... That is A-OK, -okay. so I think I am going to conclude today's episode here. It is a shorter one, but I apologize for that, uh, but there's honestly just some stuff I have to get done. As you can tell, my phone is vibrating, so maybe that has something to do with it. Who knows? But um, yeah, so I thank you all for watching. I do hope you enjoyed. Again, I'm... Just want to thank you guys all for your added support in uh, the past couple days of the series. You know, you've just really been giving me really good feedback, and I'm very appreciative of that. So, I thank you all for watching. Again, I hope you enjoyed, and I hope to see you all next time. Bye!